In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to adjust accounts payable in QuickBooks with a journal entry. Whether you're reconciling an invoice or correcting an accounting error, understanding this process is key for maintaining accurate financial records. So let's dive straight into it. First, you'll want to start by heading over to the QuickBooks website. Once you're there, look for and click on the sign in button. It's typically located at the upper right corner of the page, making it easily accessible. Once you've signed in, you're going to select QuickBooks Online from the available options. This is where all the magic happens for managing your accounting needs. Now you'll need to enter your login credentials, ensure you have your username and password handy, and go ahead to fill those in. Upon entering your credentials, simply click continue, and this will take you directly into your QuickBooks dashboard. With the dashboard open, our next action is to create a new transaction. Look for the plus new button, which is generally found on the left hand side. Clicking on this button will present you with a list of options. From this list, you'll want to choose journal entry. Once in the journal entry screen, the first piece of information you need to provide is the journal date. This is critical for keeping your records accurate, so double check the date before moving on. Next, direct your attention to the account column. Here you'll need to select the specific account that is affected by the invoice you're addressing. This could be an expense account, a revenue account, or any other account relevant to the transaction you're correcting. After selecting the account, move over to the debit column and enter the appropriate amount. Make sure this figure accurately reflects the adjustment you need to make. In the description field, go ahead and type in the reason for the journal entry. This step is important because it provides context for your records, clarifying why the entry was made for anyone reviewing it later. Moving on to the second line of your journal entry, click on the accounts drop down list and select accounts payable AP from the options presented. This tells QuickBooks that this adjustment pertains to an outstanding bill you owe. Following this, navigate to the name column. Here, you'll select the vendor from the drop down list. It's crucial to pick the correct vendor to ensure the adjustment accurately reflects your payable obligations to them. Finally, after reviewing all the entered information for accuracy and completeness, click on save and close. This action will apply your journal entry to the accounts payable ledger, ensuring that your records are up to date and truthful. By following these steps, you've successfully adjusted your accounts payable using a journal entry in QuickBooks. Remember, accuracy is vital in accounting to ensure your financial decisions are based on correct information. Thanks for watching and happy bookkeeping.